Michael Buble and his wife Louisa Nalo Pilato were left heartbroken when they found out that their son Noah, who is now 8 years old, was diagnosed with liver cancer in 2016. Following the news, the Canadian hitmaker immediately cancelled his tour and all of his music plans during chemotherapy and radiotherapy treatments. The singer's eldest child has fully recovered from cancer and is back to full health. The 46-year-old has since shared that legendary singer Sir Elton John, 75, had reached out to the musician despite them not knowing each other well. The Just Haven Met You Yet hitmaker revealed that the Rocket Man would call his family home every Sunday without fail. Michael opened up about Elton's generosity ahead of the veteran musician's birthday back in March. Addressing their relationship, the Canadian-born star called him a beautiful man. The star revealed that when his oldest son Noah was battling liver cancer Elton would always check up on the singer and his child. The Grammy winner told Magic Radio Breakfast, I didn't know him and he called me every single Sunday. Every single Sunday he would call to tell me that he and David were praying for me and that they loved us and would send toys. That's who he is, that's who he really is, so happy birthday Sir Elton, thank you. Noah, who was only three years old at the time of his diagnosis, then went through a brutal period of chemotherapy to try and rid him of the disease. In a joint Facebook statement at the time, Michael and his wife Awisana admitted that they were devastated, but vowed that they would win the upcoming battle. Thankfully for the family, and to the relief of the fans, it seemed that after initial treatment Noah was overcoming his condition. In 2017 Michael released another statement that read, We are so grateful to report that our son Noah has been progressing well during his treatment and the doctors are very optimistic about the future for our little boy. Dot will Smith banned from Oscars and all Academy events for 10 years latest Donny Osmond embraces brother as star bids farewell in final show Twitter Kate Garraway moving to better place after struggles, co-star hopes updates, he has been brave throughout and we continue to be inspired by his courage. We thank God for the strength he has given all of us. Reflecting on the horrific experience, the singer talked about the impact that the diagnosis had on them all. Speaking on the Today Show in America he said, it sucked. And it still sucks, because we went through what was the worst possible thing that you could hear as a parent and maybe as a human being. It much rather ITV have been me. I wished that many times, I wish that it happened to me. Michael and Louise Sana got engaged back in 2009 and married two years later. They now share three children Noah, Elias and Vita with the couple set to welcome their fourth child. Michael dished on their new arrival who is expected soon on The Late Late Show with James Corden. I haven't told anybody, you are the first two people that I would have told outside of my family," he said to the host and the guest of the show sitting next to him, Anthony Anderson. It's a girl. I feel so much better now not having to keep it in. People keep interviewing me and, asking, do you have any names? They always try to get the answer.